Hey everybody, Griffin Lobster here. This is more Let's Play Rayman Legends, but you already knew that. I'm gonna tell you something you didn't know though. I'm playing as Estelia today. She's got some serious tood. She's got a skull for a helm and also a skull for a spiky mallet axe thing. And you know what? We shouldn't judge her for that. Those are her choices. If she wants to kill people and wear their corpses, that is her God-given right. We need to keep an open mind here to all lifestyles on the Griffin Lobster channel. Anyway, 20,000 lums under the sea, level 2, the deadly lights. Obvious secret, here we go. This level breaks formula because it has you heading to the left. Just one of the many revolutionary ways that Rayman Legends approaches the platformer formula, also known as the platformula. In this level, deadly lights, you need to avoid the lights, for they are deadly. Fairly simple. Fairly straightforward. Let's make this a good video. Let's get 600 lums. Let's get all the teensies. Let's hang with Murphy, because he's a cool dude. He's going to be pushing buttons, helping us out. It's a pretty cush lifestyle. All you got to do is walk, fly around, push buttons. This is not a... This, on the other hand, is not a cush lifestyle. <laughs> Man, look how I'm getting through this narrow passage. I just had... <laughs> Is that really the, the best way to get through a narrow passage? Is to chafe... <laughs> Look at that. Chafe the entire lower half of your body? I don't know. But Estelia's already proven she's a girl who goes against the grain. There's a lot of words that started with G's in that sense. I just completely blanked on how to do this puzzle for a second. And remembering how to do it is not helping me. There we go. Alright! Not bad, not bad at all. Pushing buttons with Murph. Alright, so... In this mini-level, avoid the deadly light. And... Take care of this dude. Man. The toads are... I, I feel like every teensy so far this level has been being beaten on by a toad. What did they ever do to the toads? Maybe there's like like a serious civil war going on behind the scenes. And we have merely chosen sides. What are you gonna do? Such is life. Teensies are cuter. That's how it goes. Plus, they got such a dumb look on their face, too. And here's another thing. Teensies, they're getting beaten up, basically, for eternity. And... <laughs> look at that. Not even having the floor pulled out underneath that guy phased him. He's like, I don't, I don't care, I'm just gonna beat this little dude up for eternity. But that Teensy was totally fine. You give him one bop on the head, and, and that toad is out for the count. And explain this to me. Why are there patches of dirt in this otherwise industrial factory? Doesn't make sense. None of it makes sense. And that, of course, is, like, the point of this game. <laughs> Drop. You deserved it. Um. Alright. How, do how we doing on... Okay, cool. I just don't want to miss any teensies. If I remember, like, I, the first time I played this level, I missed, like, a really obvious teensy or something. And... I'm just, of course, worried that history will repeat itself. So, I want to make sure to get all of the teensies. Didn't, didn't miss any super noticeable ones there. Here? Oh, dude. Dude, you're stomping on that dude. Crushing his little body. I obviously had to intervene. Okay. I think this is the one I missed, actually, was this, this entire little level here, where you have to save the Teensy King. So obviously, that's a pretty big deal. And... Uh! I'm so bad at this. Well, that was kind of cool. He was in the foreground. No, 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 no. Uh, dang it. Poop! Uh. 
feel like I'm just in a... I feel like I'm in a funk where I'm just going to be bad at everything right now. I don't know why. I think it mostly stems from the fact that I, like, did nothing all day. <laughs> uh, yeah, I was in a kind of a do-nothing mood. Day off, you know. That'll occasionally happen. There we go. That was better. And I still want to get hit. Balls! Dang, I suck. You guys are coming down. Oh, no. You know what? There's actually, there's actually safe zones on the far edges of the platforms. So screw the stupid spinning obstacle mechanic. I can do this. Oh, natural. Keep that one down. Or, you know what? You know what else? Like, if this thing is all the way down and I'm all the way against it, it's never gonna see me. I just realized that too. If I had applied a fraction of thought to this, I could have done just fine. With all of the consternation. And this one, you can just stand in the middle. Because those are some short sighted deadly lights. So far, so good. Except for, you know, the three deaths in a row. That wasn't so good. Alright, Murphy, get down here. That's a good companion. Bend to my will. Nope, nope, nope. We're not going up there yet, Murph. We're taking care of this. There you go. Good job, Murphy. You get a gold star. Alright. We well, got the 600 lums, so... Stop worrying. Although I think I still have to get a teensy. And if memory serves, there's not much level left. Oh, there we go. I think that was the last one. Yes, it was! Awesome! And I gave that level a spanking. It would never forget if it was capable of thought. Alright. Nicely done, me. Nicely done, Murph. Estelia, you were okay. I imagine you're chafing pretty bad from squeezing through those narrow sections. Too bad you couldn't turn to a morph ball. <laughs> okay. Let's rescue one of your long-lost cousins, Ursula. Hmm. The Ninja Dojo. Oh, this is what a lot of the, uh, the challenge levels are based on. Are based on these dojo-type levels. Rescue the last teensy before time runs out. You have 120 seconds. Oh, man. So basically, you just have to be really fast. And how these work is you, you'll get all of the... Lums. Uh, uh. Get all the lum bubbles. And the faster you get them, the more lums they're worth. Um, this is a mechanic that really plays into... Uh, what the balls? I just like completely ignored the fact that that thing was even there. Oh no! This might be have to be a redo here. Yeah, those are they were those were only worth uh shoot. Man, I am rusty, dude. This is embarrassing. I used to do awesome at these dojo-type levels. Oh, pfft. And, yeah, and dying doesn't restart the level, it just restarts the area you're in. But obviously, you're on a bit of a time crunch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, awesome. Get- oh, come on! Sticking to the ledge like a- like some kind of ponce. Ooh, that was some skillful platforming. Oh, good lord. Yeah, 
Yeah, good job. See, I did that. I did a good job in that room. Alright, so now the only question is, is, did I get enough lumps? I'm thinking I didn't, because I was pretty slow. Oh, wait, actually, I got a ton. Like, way more than I needed. Okay, sweet. Pretty low standards, then, for excellence there. Whereas, I mean, even in the first couple of weeks, like, right when this game came out, like... Getting a gold trophy in the weekly challenges and daily challenges like that. It was really competitive to get into the gold. Teensy's hero. Yay! Yay, Ursula. Ursula is showing some cleave there. <laughs> yeah. I guess uh, that achievement was for getting 300 or such. Teensy's. Mansion of the Deep. Okay, this level's cool. I think, I think if, if I'm remembering correctly, this one's cool. This is the one where you can like choose which way you want to go at the beginning. I think so. I forget which way I went. I think I went left first. Oh, yeah, this is the... I remember doing... I remember this level because I had to do it so many times. Because there's this ridiculous achievement. It's kind of buggy. Um, where it's like, complete the level without getting spotted, I think. And I, and, even the, what the heck? Oh, wait, you, you gotta come back when the power's off to get that guy. The one that's screaming for help right now. Oops, did I just spoil what happened later in this level? I did. Oh, well. Um, yeah, there's an achievement that's like, do it without getting captured, but like, it's standards for what mean, what, what qualifies as quote-unquote being captured, or being caught. Um, are ridiculous to say the least. It's like, I mean, it's actually like bugged. I think because it, I don't know. It took me a lot of tries to get it, and I'm a pathetic achievement hunter whore. So I play this level like ten times, but I enjoyed it because it was a, it's a cool level. Except for this crap right here, this freaking jellyfish. Actually, that was easier than it looked. Or maybe I, it was actually hard and I just made it look easy because I'm so good. That's always a possibility. Can't, can't ever rule that one out. Okay. You two are going to swim your pattern for eternity. It's a sad life. Grab this sucker right here. And miss me. Alright, and then... Power off. Chafe, chafe, chafe. And the, the, the power off music in this level is cool. This, this game's music in general is really, really good. No complaints from me on that score. On that score! <laughs> Pun intended. Pun intended. Man, that's good. Uh, some, for some reason, the power turned off those... snakes. Or scared them away. I guess they're scared of the dark or something. <laughs> they're misunderstood creatures. You're pretty terrible. I think the, I think those guys are a Splinter Cell reference, because they, they're... Got that, they got uh, the Sam Fisher goggles. It would make sense because... Sam Fisher is, of course, a Ubisoft creation. Or is he? I think he is. <laughs> I said that without even really knowing. Come over here, grab us. The King! Okay, we do a good little Kung Fu action. There we go. Sweet. Easy peasy. Get a smoochy smoochy. It's like if if the uh, the deadly lights saw you for even a split second, like not just like uh, um to the point where they would electrocute you. If they saw you even for a split second, um 
that counted. Also, like, if you ever, uh... I don't know, there's like one path you couldn't go on, even though there was literally no security light anywhere near you. If you just went that path, it would deactivate the achievement. That was cool. I don't know. I'm ranting about an achievement. You guys don't care. But I remember it just kind of... It rankled me. It was a, it's a, this is a really cool level, but it still annoyed me. <laughs> in your little house there. Get my buddy. Did I really miss two? Teensies? What the heck? Or are they just like over this way? I guess because you can kind of do this... Do this level in any order. It'd either do the right or the left first. That might be the case. Mmm... Oh yeah, there's also a section at the end that that's like, uh, they're these like, I, I think I'm remembering this correctly. Well, you'll see. But they're like these red, uh, lasers that that would like hurt you. It's, these things right here, there's a bunch of them at the, at the end of the level. I think I'm remembering this correctly. And if they even, if you got hit by them and got hurt by them, uh, that would count as getting caught as well. So thankfully... I'm not going for that achievement here. That crap drove me utterly bonkers. Alright, and now, as you can clearly see, we can go through this door. Yes, I was remembering correctly. And this room's cool, but it's not cool when you have to do it like ten times. Okay. Okay. Uh, oh man, get my feet singed. Oh baby, that's a close shave. That is a close shave. Oh lord. See, I would not. I, if I was doing, if I was trying to get the achievement, I would not have taken a chance like that. I deserve that. I was going a little too fast there for my own good. Getting a little too fancy. And that's the end of the level. Not too shabby. Not too shabby at all. And successful acquisition of Lums and Teensies throughout. So, you know what? That was a good video. Despite what the critics say. <laughs> Some, all the harsh LP critics out there. Alright. Oh! <laughs> I was feeling so good! So we got an invasion painting next level. Yes, indeed. Just one, I hope. Yeah, just one. So that's what we'll get to next level. Time to... Uh, next video, I mean. It's time to scratch some lucky tickets. Looks like we'll also be going back to Origins. That's always fun. It, it looks like it'll be another mosquito level. Shooting me softly. I think that's a mosquito level. And we got a teensy. I'm still holding out for that 10,000 lum card. Oh my gosh. Holy crap. <laughs> that's creepy. That That's creepy. Wow. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. I am... Hmm. Gonna have to think, of th think about that. That I m summoned the 10,000 lums. Man. I'm amazing. See you guys next time. Thanks for watching.